so the player who I think will be a lot of, under a lot of pressure this year at Columbus it's not Elvis it's uh, Patrick Liner. I think if we're gonna be honest he's been very vanilla for us he know where the net is but he's very inconsistent and he is he's going like what once every third game and then he's injured and then he comes back and don't do it do anything for a bit and then he scores like four gets like four game points in a game or something like that uh, when this video comes out my video about world class athletes that one should be out and the thing is during that 2016 draft run after Matthews line uh, Pierre Luc Dubois was uh, we happened there were rumors that Patrick Liner might even go first and it's pretty funny now when you look back at it with the uh, Pierre-Luc Dubois situation with this line situation imagine if Leaf picked, picked a line instead of Austin that, that would have been kind of funny to be honest uh, anyway back to the point if I think I want to see a more of consistent line because right now for me he's just an okay player because even if you're an average like good player or want to be close to world class I think you still have still has to get points like at least every other game but if you check like check like the statistics Lana gets like one every third or fourth game and then he's like injured for a bit and then he he do nothing for a while and then he yeah it's yeah I wouldn't be surprised if he is kind of vanilla this year again we might trade him it wouldn't surprise me at all and I wouldn't I would be open for that I think right now Diego Chinakov got like the exactly the same snipe if not even better and Chinakov is a, way, is a lot younger and he has a lot of potential in him as we have seen over the last few years um, so I would actually go with Chinatov and Trey Line if he's still vanilla in the coming year. Uh, to, I would be happy with even like a first round pick or something. I would be really happy with that. I know Line's country is like 8 million but still it's a bit too much for an okay player in my opinion. So please comment down below what's your thoughts about the liner and uh, do you think he has reached his expectations and uh, yeah will he get 100 points in the future have a great one